Hey everybody, it's Eric. This is Glenda. We are d name Manager in Board Games. And Glenda, what are we unboxing today? The Umbrella Academy, the board game. Thank you, game. already known. <laughs> yeah, I want to make sure I read it right, so, or say it right. So this was re recently ran by Mantic. It's one of their newest, uh, what, GameFound Kickstarter. I'm not really sure which oh. one it ran on anymore. <laughs> uh, but I went ahead and... I believe I late pledged this. I didn't actually do this during the actual pledge. Mm -hmm. I think I looked at it afterwards and kept thinking, you know, this might be something Sam want, would want to play. Mm -hmm. well, I was about to ask you if you bought it retail, but okay. So if you guys want to see what's inside. Stay tuned. So, Umbrella Academy, the board game. Now, this is based, I believe, I know that it's a uh, show? Netflix uh -huh. show, but it's also a Dark Horse Comics. Oh. So which comes first? I came first. The comic. The comic. As always. The exclusive collector's edition box. How exclusive is this? We'll find out. Alright, so Umbrella Academy, the board game. This kind of reminds me of the rule book for Walking Dead. Mm. Kind of the size of a comic. Well, the Umbrella um, Academy is a zombie, right? Is it a zombie? Mm, I don't think so. No? What is it? <laughs> Explain. Why am I thinking this is a zombie? Why would you put me on the spot? Sorry. I saw this, thought Sam might like it. Yeah, but I remember the TV show, kind of, uh, the Netflix show. So I was thinking it's the same. Maybe not. Let's see. All right. So let's see what's in here. The new super villain missions. As I'm trying to. Pull that apart and everybody's seeing stuff bend. Everybody's cringing. Hmm. Okay. So, super villain missions. <laughs> Save the New world. New super villain mission. And playing as young heroes. Yeah, because one of the things was you got, you could do the play as the older ones or as young heroes. They mm -hmm. have like the children versions. Dangerous hazards and defeat. Villains in order to save the world. So the tokens are, they punch out real good. They're pretty thick. Uh, I guess the ones that, most of them, the second side is an umbrella. It's a fight, power, wits. Tokens. And first player token and partner token. There's a lot of tokens. So this is your oh, initial game board. Cool. And I think it's one of those ones that you start out and you have to, you have to, play your way through to get to the final mission if I remember been a That's while it's numbered you guessing and miniatures and miniatures so we're gonna set the miniatures off to the side we'll look at those in a little bit all right so this is the bottom and we have several stacks of cards we're gonna go through real quick Comic -y. A die. Are we How supposed to have dice? more than one die? Because I thought there was more when I looked at mm. Maybe it is only one. I was looking at two different things today. I don't even see the die. I might be just blind. Yep. Okay. Okay. Cards, cards, cards. Well, let's see what we have here. We don't have the die in here. Because it looks like. Okay. 
So, what's the difference? Well, I don't know. Um, what's the same yeah, difference? Yeah, you, you were like holding it, then you toss it now. <laughs> oh, I'm just trying to um, separate them out by color. So that when we go through them, it makes more sense because, you know, it's like, instead of like digging in and then all of a sudden we find out there's more of this color. And that you know how, color. You know how that happens yeah, when we do these. Yeah, it happens, true. Okay, I'm sure at some point I'm not yeah. supposed to be mixing these up. That happens too, so... It'll be okay. Because I'm usually fairly good at re-separating out if I have to. But in your contents, is it saying that there's so many of each color, or what is it saying? I know, I don't want to be ahead of you, because you're still, like, you know, removing the plastic and sorting all these different colors. Yeah, but if it was... And you need to catch up. <laughs> Just kidding. But, but if one of those things said we were supposed to keep the cards separate... <laughs> there is been... no such thing as just on the components, remember? We're not reading the whole game uh, instruction. it's just the components here. Alright, well, so how many of these of... are there? Okay, so you have that black one, hazard, standard, and villain ones. There's a lot. Okay, this one, these are all black too. This is skills. Advantage. Feud. Blue is ally. No, green is ally. Purple is super, super villain and villain. So well, yep, that's it. That's all. Okay, so what are these? Uh, these are our on. heroes, I'm assuming. What is it? Oh. No, these are villains. It actually says villain. These are our villains. <laughs> Good. It says they're villains. So it says the villains here are purple. Okay. Well, why is it not purple? And we have devastated cards. The location is devastated. Card cannot be removed. So I guess this is if we, one of these locations gets destroyed. It's so weird. They're not there. I know. What are the green ones? They can be the ally okay. or advantage. Yeah, so that's the ally right there. All right, so we have 11 ally cards. And the red? Feud. So you got anger issues and... So these are feud cards. Mm -hmm. Okay. How come so, it doesn't even say that anger issues? Well, it says like, like one of these, the power, choose a hero to draw three cards, uh, move each hero to any location, heroes may be moved to, so it, like an extra power for, mm. okay, I get it, power, yeah, that makes sense. Uh, the beige ones? You seeing Mission it? cards? Probably, no seeing in here. They just miss out on like the whole. Some of this might have been Kickstarter stuff. You said the pur the purple is the villains. You have super and just the villain. And these cards are double sided. You telling us? And showing at the same time. <laughs> Yeah, 
And then what are these? That's the skill. That could be the hazard. Again, black standard and villain ones. And then what advantage. They? So, so they're all black right here, Eric. That's what I'm trying to tell you. See? Huh. So I wonder if they were supposed to be kept separate somehow. Oh, it won't be very So you hard. have the the lines here, different colors. Hmm? Those are different colors. So that's the wound. You know. Yeah, those are the wound. And this is just the hazard. Those are the hazard? This one, yeah. Missile strike, meteor. Villain one. <laughs> okay, so there's three hazard, standard, and villain ones on that stack. Well, I mean, there is some difference here. Mm -hmm. Okay, so there are actually. I'm not sure where the save the world one comes in. Is it the first player? Who knows? Hmm. Alright, and we have the green, we have the white, and we have the red, and the black. So mm -hmm. actually four. That's the feud. That's the advantage. Well, the feud is the smallest one, so... So what was that that you opened there? Those are few too because they're red. But I think that was different because of the back. The whole back thing is kind of throwing me a little bit. Because they're all the same. Yeah. And the advantage. There's a lot of those. Okay. Okay, and so these are the skill, right? Yep, so look at that. They got different lines. Uh, the skills do. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. So Space Boy, Horror, Horror, Vanya, Rumor. Oh, the skills of the characters. Right? Mm, I believe so. See, like these are Krakens. And Rumor. Space Boy. Horror. I'm assuming seance. <laughs> mm -hmm. Number five. Okay. So all these get separated out as in the characters' cards. And then we have what are the hazards? Is that what we're calling all these? Um, yeah, that's the hazard, standard, and villain ones. Okay, so we have a meteor. There's really a lot of cards. Missile. So yeah, there's a lot of here. Sawed in half. Card trick. Beautiful assistant. 
four score and seven feet tall, long stride, stovepipe smash, monumental blow, sharpening of axe, and then we've got just some basic attacks it looks like. Come look at Hazel, target, cadenza, cadenza, I don't, concert, okay. Crescendo. And then there's wound. So there's different wound cards. Two different bits of uh two different bits of artwork for the wound cards. And then you got some more missile strikes here. Ally in trouble. Stop playing and finish them. You got some different search and destroy. Terminate. Roll out. Was this Transformers? <laughs> Combine fire, expendable, time travel, time assassination, and then some more wound. Red licorice and Armageddon. Find them hazel. Come look at this cha cha, sugar rush, your concerto, ensemble, harmony, confusion, loneliness, regret, rage, jealousy. And the list goes on, because there's a thousand God, these things. there is so many cards. Well, I think it's so that, it, you know, that it's got where possibly you can get a bunch of the same cards all at once. It's probably a draw deck once we go into the rules. There is a lot, though. All right, so let's take a look at these miniatures, shall we? Because that looks like Abraham Lincoln. You got a robot, and you got a smaller robot. I'm sorry. <laughs> cool. And this looks like the possibly like the, the different style henchmen that we have probably. Since we have multiples of these guys. Yeah. That's good. And bigger, taller. I like it. Ooh, and then we have robots. Gotta have, gotta have robots, right? Yeah. Abraham Lincoln. And then this last box, it looks like it has one more of each one of the henchmen characters, including the robot. And then both characters and the main villains. I like it. I like it. Oh, I'm sorry. Good. You know, I'm, I'm kind of glad though Mantic went with a thinner looking figure. Because if you remember with when we did the unboxing of Walking Dead, it's yeah. like they were well fed. <laughs> we'll use the word well fed. There, okay, so that kind of come, um, uh, weird looking because they're like chubby, but they're not. Stuffy. So you got the kid characters too. So yeah, you can see, play they got a nice. I, I like this one. And this must be what the first player token. The form, first player token, yeah. Yeah, the token is the partner token. Oh, must be a cardboard. Must be. Playing the violin. I like that scale. It reminds me of that character from Scooby Doo. Which one? Was a well, was it? No. Was it Scooby Doo or was it Johnny Quest? I was gonna say I don't really remember Scooby Doo, but maybe it was Johnny maybe Quest. Maybe I just don't remember it. <laughs> yeah. 
their characters looks nice. Their figures. It's not ah. big and short. You think it's short. So that is the full unboxing of Umbrella Academy. Hopefully at this point you saw 360 degree views of all these miniatures because, you know, that's what we do. We do 360 degree views. And you saw all the cards. And you saw our confusion with all the cards. And our confusion of everything. You got to see the one die that comes in the game. It's a 10 sided die. So if you like what you see, I I'm assuming it's going to retail. I didn't look, I don't remember, and I just don't know. Maybe it would. As always, support your local gaming. We support Discover Games in Fayetteville, Georgia. And Dan Wolf Games in Griffin, Georgia. Game on, everybody. Game on.